Hey everyone, so today I want to talk about a Channel 4 programme which is More Sex Please, We're British. Now I absolutely love Channel 4 sex based programmes. I don't really watch them if they're on any other channel, but there's something about the ones that Channel 4 do, and they do a lot of them, as you may know, that just makes them so much more interesting to watch and just slightly unique and they're not even cringeworthy. You're watching them and it's just the most natural thing in the world. And now More Sex Please, We're British looks at the sex toy industry which I personally cannot recall ever seeing any sex toy um, driven show on Channel 4. You know, most of them are sex education or sex health or, you know, how to have better sex kind of shows. This one looks at the sex toy industry and it may sound boring. Um, a lot of it to begin with especially is all facts and figures and how many, how many of this is sold and how many of that is sold and which city in the UK um, puts the most ordered it, orders in every day, which is hilarious, by the way. Um, it's not my city, but I imagine if you're sitting there watching it and it says the city that you live in or the city that you come from um, buys the most sex toys, quite amusing I imagine. But it's very well formatted, it, it does sound a little dull if you say it's all about facts and figures and, and it's not just, you know, it looks at various different things and you know the unique products that you look at and think who would want that in a million years, you know, down to your more basic ones. It looks at the customer services and sort of what the main requests are and the sort of help and things and I'm not going to tell you any of the facts and figures primarily because I can't remember them exactly as they are just sort of average but I was shocked at some of them like how many people are buying these things all the time and I'm like what that's a ridiculous amount of people you know you kind of think now nah, there will be maybe one or two orders a day or something a phenomenal amount of orders it's fantastic very eye-opening um you are watching it thinking, all right, yeah, I've seen one of those before, I know what that is, I can not name that, but I've seen it. And then you're thinking, what the bloody hell is that? So it's very fascinating and it's very entertaining for all the right reasons. In the staff who work in this main warehouse, I think it was, there's three, I think it said, where main warehouses in the UK, and this one, the one that's being filmed, is the primary one, the one that, you know, most of the orders come from. Um, but of course, you won't know that because apparently the packaging is discreet, which is interesting and quite beneficial I guess. Um, you know the staff who work there clearly love their job. I mean can you imagine going home at night and uh, it'd be kind of weird. Um, and also can you imagine, you know, what would you, what would you do for a living? Oh I, I pack sex toys into boxes. Get in there. So it is really really interesting, very funny as well and what I like is that it is done tastefully and um, it, it doesn't, <laughs> I wouldn't say it doesn't poke fun and I need to watch what I'm saying in this video. It doesn't it, do, it doesn't, you know, it, I'm going to use that word again, it doesn't poke fun at people who buy these things, um, but at the same time it doesn't say, yes, everybody must have these. It's very balanced, which I thought was quite interesting and not what I was expecting. You have views from sex experts and things in there who talk about their experiences with these things. And um, yeah, but it's very balanced, but very funny, but it's tastefully done. You know, they're not saying, oh, haha, look at what these people are buying, because it's, it, it lets us see that it's quite a natural, normal thing to want to buy. I mean some of the things are a bit like that's not necessarily that normal but generally speaking you know it's very interesting Um, definitely one of Channel 4's finer sex based shows because of its originality and its uniqueness. It's very well formatted, well edited, well put together. Didn't ever sit and think it was boring in the slightest. Do check it out, it is on 4OD. You will love it. It's really, if somebody said to me do you want to watch a TV show that looks at um, how sex toys are packed into boxes and how many are sold each day? I'd be like, no, get a grip. But it's very, very funny and very entertaining and, as I said, quite eye-opening. It is good. Let me know your thoughts. Um, uh, this video will probably end up getting flagged. I have to watch what I put in the tags in the video below. Um, but let me know your thoughts and I'll see you all next time. Bye.